back on the bike beautiful sunny morning in Dublin in October pulling out of Ashtown gonna head for Hoth today heading for the beach I want to see if I can make it or see how far I can make it off-road and cycle paths and starting on the Royal Canal we're gonna head all the way in the Royal Canal into Docklands then hopefully get onto the Hout Road there's like a cycle path there just gonna try and do as much as I can off-road, off main roads beautiful start to the morning right by the canal just got to the Broom Bridge in Cabra that's it behind me there. That's where uh, William Rowan Hamilton etched the formula for was it fundamental quaternion multiplication, as you do when he was walking by a couple of hundred years ago. But probably most Dubliners will know Broom Bridge now in the next year or two because this is where the Lewis is going. The new Lewis extension. It's kind of going in there behind me. Still a lot of work to do. But I'll be some addition to the area when it's when it's completed. Just gone back under the rail line around Glasnevin, between Cabra and Glasnevin. To my left is Glasnevin Cemetery. Coming into Glasnevin village now and then towards Drumcondra. Taking a break at the canal here in Drumcondra. That's that's Brendan Bean keeping an eye on my bike. Passing under the shadow, literally under, of Croke Park. Would have been slightly different around here yesterday. There's over 80,000 people at the All-Ireland Final. A lot quieter today, Sunday morning. gone as far as the canal path can take me. That's lock one behind. You see the sign behind me and it's the North Strand Road up above it and I've got to get up on that now and head for Hout. The canal does flow into the Liffey a bit further down and there's still a couple of hundred meters maybe 500 meters to get there but it's, I've got to go on main road now because there's no path. From Croke Park there, there was a lot of broken glass on the ground and a few people sleeping rough as well. I don't know if it's ideal for cycling. There's a path all the way from Ashtown but um, some of it's smoother than others. Well after a little bit of zigzagging, but only about five minutes on main roads, there's the North Docklands behind me. Pullbeg chimneys. And there's my path to Hout. We follow the Hout Road and it should be cycle lane all the way from here. As it turns out, there's a large chunk of the path, cycle path, closed off for extension works. So they're extending the road and the path itself. So I have to get onto the road there for a while. A lot of traffic. Only a couple of minutes though. By the Bull Island, by uh, St. Anne's Park in Rohini. Whereas there was no cyclists on the Royal Canal, it was pretty jam, chock full of cyclists here on the road to Hout. Snack and water time. And Hout is just around the corner. Rolling into Hout, about 20 kilometres from Ashtown flat all the way. Really simple cycle and lovely on a day like today. So all that remains for me now is to hoover up a bit of grub here in Hout and then head back home. <laughs> 